welcome to Baby's Morning Out. This program is designed for our friends zero to 24 months. We'll go ahead and get started with our ABCs. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time won't you sing with me? Nice job, friends. We're gonna start with a book. It's called Zoo Babies by Andrew Blyman. Hello there. I'm Becco and I'm an Asian elephant. When I grow up, I'll be one of the largest animals in the land. They call me radar ears and I'm a fennec fox. My big ears help me to hear yummy insects crawling across the land. My name is Minari and I'm a, Sum a Sumatran orangutan. Check out my bright orange mop top. Hello, I'm Hoover and I'm a tawny frog mouth. They call me a frog mouth because of my beak. I can open it really wide. I'm Kai and I'm a spotted hyena. Don't be fooled by my puppy dog good looks. We hyenas are more related to cats than dogs. My name is Omni and I'm an aardvark. I'm Miracle Kitten and I'm an Ocklet. Hi, I'm Hazani and I'm a gorilla. Kali and Dugra here. We're Bengal Tiger Twins. They call me Roby and I'm a kangaroo. My name is Sasa and I'm a banded mongoose. I'm Tahina and I'm a crowned Sifka. When I was born, my mommy couldn't tear, care for me, so the zookeepers do. My name is Mafa, Manifa and I'm a pygmy hippo. Good day, I'm Mardi, a wombat. I come from Australia. My name is Kalispell and I'm an Akpai. Hello there, I am an anteater, otherwise known as a tam Tamandua. And I'm Bella, a beluga whale. As I get older, I'll turn all white like my mom and dad. Learned about lots of ant baby zoo animals today, didn't we, friends? All right, we're gonna do, if you're happy and you know it, are you ready? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. 
If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, do all three, clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, do all three, clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, do all three, clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray. Nice job, friends. Now we're going to read from the Usborne book some nursery rhymes. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home wagging their tails behind them. Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow? with silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids in a row. Ba, ba, black sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. One for my master, one for the dame, one for the little boy who lives down the lane. Ba, ba, black sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse ran down. Hickory dickory dock. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb, his fleece was white as snow. And everywhere that Mary went, Mary went, Mary went. Everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider and sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. Girls and boys come out to play. Girls and boys come out to play. The moon doth shine as bright as day. Leave your supper, leave your sleep, and join your playfellows in the street. Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such fun and the dish ran away with the spoon. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. All right, nice job, friends. I have one last story to share with you, and then we'll sing one more song. This is called The Three Little Fish and the Big Bad Shark. Once upon a time, there lived a mama fish and her three little fish, Jim, Tim, and Kim. It is now time, said the mama, for each of you to make a home in the deep blue sea. So off they went. The first little fish named Jim swam away and he met a seahorse playing in some seaweed. Can I have some of the seaweed so I can build a house? Take as much as you can carry, said the seahorse. Jim gathered the seaweed and made a weedy little house. Jim had just finished building his seaweed house when he heard a big bad shark knocking at the door. Little fish, little fish, let me come in. The little fish trembled and replied, not by the skin of my finny fin fin. Then I'll munch and I'll crunch and I'll smash your house in, roared the shark. So the big bag shark munched and crunched and he ate every bite of that seaweed house. And Jim swam away just in time. Soon Jim found his brother Tim. Don't worry, Jim. We fish stick together. You can help me build a sandy little house. Jim and Tim had just started to relax in the sandy little house when the big bag shark came knocking on the door. Little fish, little fish, let me come in. To which the brave little fish replied, not by the skin of my finny fin fin. Then I'll munch and I'll crunch and I'll roar that seaweed house in. 
So the big bad shark munched and crunched and he ate all the sand, mouthful by mouthful. Jim and Tim swam as fast as they could until they reached their sister, Kim. Kim was sitting in her house in an old wooden ship. The big bad shark destroyed our houses. Don't worry, you can live with me, said Kim. And they did. The three little fish just finished lunch when they heard the big bad shark knocking on the door. Little fish, little fish, let me come in. To which the smart little fish replied, not by the skin of my finny fin fin, then I'll munch and I'll crunch and I'll smash your house in, roared the shark. The big bad shark munched and he crunched, but he couldn't smash the house in. And all his teeth fell out. Uh-oh. The three little fish were safe at last. That shark was left to eat seaweed. He didn't have any teeth. <laughs> all right, friends, we'll finish up with a song we're gonna sing. A tisket, a tasket, a flower making basket. I wrote a letter to my love and on the way I dropped it. I dropped it, I dropped it. Yes, on the way I dropped it. A little boy, he picked it up and put it in his pocket. All right, friends. I enjoyed spending some time with you today and I will see you next time. Bye.